today, y'all, we gonna package up a big order. What is up, guys? Welcome and or welcome back to my channel. It is your girl, Zania Shy. If you are new here, welcome. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you for continuing to put up with this madness. Um, as you guys can tell from the title of this video, I will be basically showing y'all or explaining to y'all how I'm prepping for my very first Black Friday. Technically, this is my third Black Friday, but because I've been in business for, or my second, second or third, because I've been in business for about two years now, but I actually just made an official website, um, launched my website March of this year. So my website has only been active for about six or seven months. Um, and I'm officially doing like a real Black Friday sale, like a, you know, a website sale, basically. So I have my notes here so I can kind of stay on track with what I want to talk about. So basically, it's like a Black Friday prep video. So what I've been doing to prepare myself for Black Friday, because again, this will be my first official with my stores, my site and stuff. Um, so yeah, the first thing I'm going to talk about is creating sales. So... What I did is I kind of like watched around um, to see what other people were doing because Black Friday is definitely, definitely competition. Like, definitely. Everybody's a competition for Black Friday. Even the big name stores. Um, <laughs> get off your foot. <laughs> the big name businesses as well as other small businesses. Ow. Other small businesses are definitely competition. So, I kind of just like looked around, um, watched around and saw what people did. I actually like looked last year for a lot of different things that people did in different sales. So that kind of helped me create the sales that I want. But I'm stuck between two different sales for an actual Black Friday. Like I have my Cyber Monday sale, not changing that. But my Black Friday sale, I'm like stuck between doing one thing and something else. Um, so basically just like watch around a competition, see what people are doing, try to do something that'll bring like more attention to yourself and to your store or to your site or your Instagram or however you, you know, run your business. Definitely try to do things differently from your competition, obviously. Um, the second thing is making flyers. So I make my flyers on Canva. Um, I've tried to make a flyer on Fonto. I don't really like how they look. Some people make them on Fonto and they look really, really nice. Maybe it's just me. I'm kind of like creative illiterate. <laughs> so it I'm not really that creative honestly like yeah not that creative um so the flyer that I made it's for the original sale that I was thinking I might keep it because I might just keep that sale um but I am gonna make like another flyer and then put it put them side by side in this group that I'm in to kind of see like um what they think which flyer they think will be better please don't throw this on the floor Emory's like in the stage where he's throwing his bobo every day um so that's flyers promoting i've been i haven't really started promoting the black friday sale um because i honestly don't have a flyer a, a permanent flyer like i have the two different flyers that i said I, I have so i haven't really started promoting the black friday sale um but i did kind of promote on my instagram and facebook that we are preparing for black friday so that's a lot of preparation because okay you can have it because my business is 90 percent handmade i think about two items from two three actually so yeah like 90 percent handmade three items on my actual site i didn't make myself i actually got from a vendor um so there's a lot of preparation for me because i make everything by myself it's just me i don't have a team i don't have not yet anyway i don't have a team i don't have anyone else that basically knows my recipes and like how i do things so it's just me so i've definitely been promoting everywhere i've definitely been promoting everywhere like every social media platform that i have i've been promoting my site my my um black friday sale and that we're prepping for black friday so that's definitely that i say promote everywhere make sure you're promoting on instagram twitter facebook um pinterest anywhere that you have basically tiktok if you're advertising your business anywhere i say promote your, your sale everywhere like once i finally do get the flyer they're probably going to get tired of seeing the flyer but i'm literally going to be posting this black friday flyer every single day at least three times a day in between posting product pictures um the fourth thing is handmade prep um take make sure like if your business is like mine where you basically make 
half of everything or almost everything i would say definitely take out time out of your days your weeks to dedicate a day to making product take a day to like make products like i um last week actually took a day and made about two or three different products um just to kind of mass produce i i anticipate a very big sale for myself I'm speaking that into the universe now that I will do really, really well for Black Friday. So I've been mass producing everything. Um, so this week I'm actually going to take time probably later on today to make some other products that I haven't made. And then I have one product that I have to make like a couple more um, of them. And then I have some new products that are actually dropping. One just dropped, which is the eight ounce lymph strength oil um, that dropped on the 20th yesterday as a matter of fact yeah they dropped yesterday on the 28th um we are still in october you guys october is almost over cannot wait um and then i have a kids oil thank you emory <laughs> i have a kids oil that actually drops november 1st um so definitely make sure you take time out of whatever you're doing to mass produce things for the sale that way you I would rather have more than enough product than to not have enough product at all. The final, th nope, not the final thing. So another thing is counting inventory. I actually have to set aside a day for that too, to count all my inventory and make sure that everything is marked correctly on the site. Um, I may shut my site, that like um, lock my site for like a day to make sure I count inventory and everything is accounted for correctly. That way nobody's like shopping and kind of throwing off my count um so yeah definitely double check your inventory count make sure double count triple count quadruple count count as many times as you have to to make sure the numbers you have on paper match the numbers on your site and then the last thing is double checking your website that leads in perfect right into it double checking your website make sure everything on your website is visible um i actually have to take new product pictures which i'm gonna do today because i have time um so i'm gonna get him a little bit more situated He's teething, so he's tearing this thing up. Um, so yeah, I have to take new product pictures because the product pictures I have, the background is a little too overwhelming. Um, so I'm kind of going to simple it down a little bit and take new product pictures. And yeah, just double check my website. Make sure every product picture is up to date. Um, all wholesale things is in the correct orders. Like everything is in the correct tab that it should be in. And that, you know, your website is functioning properly. No glitches, no nothing. Um, whenever I do sales, I always generally try to go in and, like, create a cart. So that would be an abandoned cart. But I create a cart to make sure that, you know, whatever the sale is, is matching perfectly at checkout. So that's basically it. I'm ex super, super excited for my first official Black Friday um, sale and Cyber Monday sale. I hope you guys shop with me. Those of you who have not already, those of you who have, I hope you should continue to shop and shop again. And don't forget to shop Shy Girl Inc. I will put the website on the screen as well as in the description box below the Instagram as well. You guys follow us. Once we hit 2K on Instagram, we are doing a massive giveaway, like massive giveaway. I just may give away every single product that we have. <laughs> like that, that's huge. That, that'd be a huge giveaway. Um, so yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in my next one.